Hello, Freddy Resident Evil Who Reviews. And today I'm doing Kim Possible Motor Ed. And uh, in this, uh, Kim Ron go to this uh, fun carnival. And uh, Ron does, well, Kim tells her dad about the last time they're there and uh, hit her and Ron on one of these uh, intense spin rides and Ron just pukes while was inside and the puke landed like a clown that sued him and had uh, Ron pay for his dry cleaning so uh, Ron decides to eat a lighter now and uh, he seems well when uh, Wade calls Kim saying there was uh, some tips of a uh, uh, the valuable uh, car parts. Boo, and he came her off the ride. Yeah, he got a blow. I think I find that the same clown hold, I was holding up on Brother when uh, he came mention him when they were in the ride, so. Mm. And turn, turn to one that's causing the tips. Is this uh, person named Motor Ed, who's known as the great one of the greatest uh, mechanical engineers, and they got kicked out of this uh, secret government uh, group because yeah, they have a dress code which meant no mullets. And there's one other thing that uh, Motor Ed is obsessed with and car parts. It's his mullet. It is pride and joy. Hmm. And I was at the fair, uh, Kim Romney, this uh, kid named Felix. Right now, uh, Felix's mom and Kim's uh, dad work for the same uh, scientific center or something with uh, Felix's mom being a uh, doctor of cyber robotics. And Kim is uh, kind of, or just kind of gets uh, awkward. When uh, she finds out uh, that Felix is in a wheelchair. First, she's just trying to be sensitive to him. Same around, they don't go on any intense rides. And then when they go to see this uh, dirt bike uh, thing, she actually prints out a, a list of some wheelchair ramp locations in the Middleton School area. And uh, she does say I keep saying the wrong thing and Ron being the one that does that treating Felix like he's a regular kid. And later on Kim gets uh, angry at Ron for seriously uh, playing against uh, uh, Felix in basketball. Like he's seriously trying to win. Hmm. Uh, then more as he shows up in, in the dirt bike thing to steal some uh, car parts. Um, while Kim is uh, chasing them, Wade tells her to throw her uh, hair buds and when she does, it releases some spikes which flats the tires from the ATVs. So, cool. And uh, Kim uh, had Wade send uh, a rumor around that her dad made this uh, awesome uh, car part just, and just uh, let it be to catch uh, a motor ad and it kind of works a bit of a fight with the uh, motor ad and Kim and that and they're in this uh, part of the, the building where there's a big fan that can blow a uh, right or left but hmm. um, Ron actually gets uh, trapped in where the uh, awesome car part was supposed to be, and uh, yeah, and oh yeah, there's a good part with the uh, uh, Kim and her uh, brothers where see that's yeah, hold up her uh, uh, one of her brothers and tell her what the message is, and he just threatens if he don't let down, he's gonna tell the mom that she blew, blew up at one of her. Uh, at uh, I think biology, at uh, test to save a 
have flown the village or something. And uh, came out to find where uh, Ron is when uh, Mort Ed calls and faxes him a map to where uh, his lair is. Yeah, it's around his lair in a junkyard in New Jersey. Yeah, Rizzo. Uh, Felix uh, tags along to save Ron, even though Kim thinks it's too dangerous, but Kim, or, uh, Felix actually points out it's too dangerous for her to go alone. Uh, later on, she finds out that uh, Felix's mom actually puts some robotic parts in a wheelchair, like robotic hands, and that's him. Um, uh, did more suit up so for the wheelchair just making it fly. Uh, turn out that uh, Mora's plan is just a uh, meaningless chaos. He says he wants to make uh, the world the rockinest uh, junkyard ever. Yeah, very attractive. Yeah, and I uh, came to it said uh, to feed Mora Ed and in the end where uh, Ron and Felix are uh, playing basketball, Kim joins in and not feeling the awkward anymore. Um, yeah, I think it's a good episode. I think uh, John Maggio as a uh, Mordea well, probably has some fun with this role. Ugh. I don't know he's gonna have, he, he had to have more fun in the next episode than Mordea is in. And um, this is so I uh, it's that it came in a uh, perfect person with feeling uh, a little awkward around uh, Felix and he still said uh, tell Ron why he see, feels awkward, like he still feels guilty that he can't walk and see can and then still said uh, that's some stupid thing like but he tells uh, Felix to uh, stand watch uh, Felix the scratcher by saying that he means sit watch and see uh, or he's saying he's kidding and, she just said, uh, uh, "Quarterback with her hand, thinking she said uh, some wrong." <laughs> yeah, that's a uh, Kim. The uh, feeling easy is kind of funny, but hmm. uh, I think Ronaldo so or uh, the help Kim or so the help Kim that he so treat uh, someone with disability as a normal person, even if they do have that, and. Uh, I do kind of like uh, one of the more ads, uh, a headman who just wants uh, a hoagie and just answering, he just gets them wrong to want them for, for, for an hour. And it's quite funny that Ron has uh, tried ordering or trying to get Kim to order some stuff from uh, a Bruno Nacho uh, takeout while he was kidnapped and the guy, the one more uh, guys Place in order as well as everybody else when I eat them. Ugh, I don't know. And, uh, yeah, it, it is a decent episode, and yeah, the next episode, which is the second more Ed one, came as the feeling of the Ed jealous because Ron and Felix seem to be uh, having fun without her, so I'll get more. If not next time, and tell them, I'll see you guys later.